Hi, my name is Carla, and this is Trace Estrellas Gallery, and I am weaving uh, a twill shawl on my uh, Rio Grande, New Mexico walking loom. And I will start with a little demonstration. I am um, weaving in the weft and the yarn that's going horizontal or vertical um, is my warp. So the warp is prepared before you start to weave. Um, and the warp is during my shuttle. And the yarn that I'm using is a uh, local churro wool that is a regional heritage breed. There are um, some suppliers here in Taos, New Mexico that supply us with this wool. It is um, single ply to resemble hand spun. So to create my twill pattern, I have to uh, treadle in a very specific order. And with a walking loom, you treadle using your feet and you stand while you while you weave. So the neat thing about this loom, we had it made here in Taos. Um, a local woodworker made it for us using only hand tools. So um, this is a one of a kind loom made to um, function exactly like a loom built in 1775. So this is technology from the Spanish colonial era, and we weaving, um, especially with a diamond pattern, there's four positions that you can put your feet in, you can treadle. So this is my middle position, and then I throw the shuttle, I beat, I change my feet, change my position, and I repeat in a very specific pattern. So this is what's going to create my diamond. So the treadles control my harnesses, which are up here, and the harnesses control the warp, which is what creates your pattern. So um, as long as I keep moving my feet in the proper order, I will produce a diamond twill fabric. And my fourth position are my outer treadles, and that raises the two middle harnesses. Um, so there's a direct link between the treadling and the raising of the harnesses. This allows the weaver to create a pattern um, that's loom driven um, on their piece of fabric. This particular pattern is a diamond twill pattern and uh, you can see on the surface of my shawl that I'm weaving here that there are diamonds. So in order to create the diamonds, the weaver must take eight steps in one direction, and then at the end of eight steps, must reverse her treadling to complete the diamond shape. 